Sparrow Revenge 2020 Mesh Generation. In this video, we will show you how to generate a triangular mesh model from a point cloud using Faro Revenge 2020. To generate a mesh, select one or multiple point clouds from the project panel and click the Generate command in the Mesh menu. The Mesh Generation tool offers customized mesh generation steps according to different requirements. Select a predefined mesh generation profile from the drop down list. Choose between Technical Object, Design Object, Small Artistic Object, Sculpture, or you can select Custom Profile to configure every step of the mesh generation process. The basic settings of the mesh generation are Enable GPU Processing, Enable Global Alignment, Enable Point Cloud Filtering enable thinning or smoothing, or generate colored texture atlas. Configure the mesh generation settings by adjusting the resolution parameter and the density to match the desired level of detail. Use a higher value of density to generate a denser mesh with a higher level of detail. The mesh post-processing steps can be freely added or removed from the mesh generation profile by using the corresponding icons. To add a mesh post-process step, select an option from the drop-down list. The available options are Mesh Fixing, Mesh Decimation, Mesh Relaxation, and Mesh Smoothing. Click Add to insert the selected processing step into the current mesh generation profile. Adjust the processing parameters based on your preference or consult the user manual for a detailed explanation. Click Generate Mesh to start generating a mesh with the current profile. To save the current mesh generation profile, edit the profile name in the corresponding text field and click Save. The new saved profile will be accessible from the drop-down list for later use. Click Done to finalize the mesh generation tool and return to the home mode. Congratulations, you can now generate your first mesh with Pharaoh Revenge 2020.